All right, we're going to open up this and see what comes inside of it. I'm a very nice little binder type thing. I like that. This is the keyboard. And it shows where you connect the tablet to it. It really actually is self-explanatory. On the back of it, it makes a little holder stand. Let me unplug this. It's magnetic, pops right into place. And that is how it looks. That looks like a laptop. All right, we're going to go through. and set this up together. Wow, the keyboard automatically works. You don't have to plug nothing else in. That's cool. You set up your Wi-Fi. I always like typing on screen. It's hard to get used to using one of these with a keyboard. Use Express Settings, and we'll be setting up our accounts. Your Microsoft Hotmail account is what they want here. Okay, this is Microsoft's protection identity, identity verification request. If you don't see a request to approve, open the Microsoft account app. I'm going to code a different way. Next. It is not popping up whatever it's supposed to. Microsoft account app. Let me find my phone and see if I can pull it up on that. Oh, 
All right, I had to actually install that onto my tablet because I didn't understand how it works. But if you push the button, it tells you to call you. It will call you with a code, and it will not take that long. I just did not know how to do it. So now it's going to and setting things up but on your Windows tablet. I really like the keyboard stand that comes with this. If you look at it carefully, you'll see you got plenty of hand space. You type like a, a normal keyboard. Plenty of hand space, mouse area, and when you're done, it's got this felt, I guess it is. Feels good. It's like suede. I'm not sure what it is, but I like the feel of it. And again, here's your quick start guide to help you through this. It tells you where everything is on your tablet. It shows you how to make your uh, keyboard into a little stand, which is really obvious. It says to charge it for 10 hours the first time. You do need to have a Microsoft Hotmail account to fully run on Windows 8. So I would advise you getting one of those. Do not turn your tablet off while it is installing Windows 8.1. Just let it keep on running. <laughs> 